Hello guys, with Ashes Corona gonna ask, so the question arises as to who will win this match and advance to the super class. Yes, you heard me right, it's not great ball class, it is super class. For both Ash and Corona, this holds to be a very important match. Though Ash is the Alola champion and has defeated Corona before in a gym battle, one must not forget the Korean has defeated Pikachu even before the Korea was able to make a wall. So from the teaser and the preview we got, one can easily say that this match will be a 2v2 with Ash using Gengar and Dragonite. Pretty strong Pokemon, no doubt on that. But it is confirmed that Gengar will be defeated by Lucario at some point as well. So the match will be decided between Mega Lucario and Dragonite. So before jumping any conclusions to who will actually win, let's go through a few blurbs from the Cerebi source thread. It says, Satoshi has decided to enter the Battle Festival, a battle tournament held in Kalos region. Lots of Pokemon World Championships participants are entering this tournament, so it's a golden opportunity to increase one's rank. After successfully winning his way through several battles, Satoshi ends up to fight Korina, a gym leader he's previously battled in the Kalos region. In the match where his progression to the super class is at stake, how is Satoshi planning on taking on Korina's Mega Lucario? The next scoop too, which says fierce fight in official Pokemon World Championship matches. It says, here comes the next powerful opponent for Ash, as well as a battler who's no less skilled than a champion. The scoop 3 which says, a super fierce match where progression to Pokemon World Championship super class is at stake, Satoshi vs Kurina. It says, Satoshi is preparing in the battle festival where it's possible to instantly increase your rank in Pokemon World Championships and ends up facing Carney in a match where only one more win will let him progress to the super class. The battle becomes super fierce with intense moves clashing against one another. How will it end? Finally, the title says Satoshi vs Corina, who will win? Corina is Lucario capable of Mega Evolving, which simply powers a Pokemon. And Corina herself is burning with determination to settle the score with Ash, who defeated her in a prior match. Corina is one in body and soul with a Pokemon when she fights. She's a fighting type expert. So next description is actually about Lucario. It says, when it Mega Evolves, its body grows in size and its attack power increases as well. Its strength is unmanageable. The blurb says, Satoshi grins even as he sees Mega Lucario's power. What kind of plan does he have? So the blurb kind of confirms the fact that Corina is no less skilled than a champion, which means this battle will be really hard for Ash, though he's a Alola champion. Moreover, Corina is burning determination to settle her score with Satoshi. So in this situation, we really don't know to who will actually win. I really hope Ash wins this one. If supposing Ash does lose this match, then he has to fight Corina once again and defeat her, which probably might not happen because she's a recurring character from a previous series. But if Corina or Gurken has to play some role with Ash and his potential Lucario, this match might mark Ash's first defeat in the Pokemon World Championships. It is interesting to note that Ash will have to win all the way through many opponents in the battle festival before he could fight Corina, which means he will already surpass the Great Ball class and he has to fight Corina to actually enter the super class. If you guys like the video, leave a like and hit that subscribe button. Thank you guys. Until next time, see ya. Peace.